Hi, I'm Senator Jeff Merkley, and today I'm going to talk about the challenge we have with global warming and something that we can do right now that will have a significant impact. The challenge is that we have been burning so many fossil fuels, oil, gas, and coal, and it's produced a tremendous amount of carbon dioxide. And that carbon dioxide is acting like a blanket that is causing the earth to warm. In fact, already the warming is causing dramatic consequences. We have seen a big increase in the ferociousness of our forest fires. We have seen droughts affecting a good portion of our agriculture. And we have seen rising sea levels and mega storms. All of this is just with a small temperature rise. So think about how much worse this will get as the years progress. So we have to act now. We have to quit pumping so much oil out of the ground and, and burning it. We also need to quit digging so much coal out of the ground and burning it. In fact, in order to prevent the temperature of the Earth from rising more than 2 degrees centigrade, or about 4 degrees Fahrenheit, we have to leave 80% of the oil, gas, and coal reserves in the ground. We need to keep it in the ground. And that may sound daunting, but fortunately, we have both the energy conservation technologies and the clean energy technologies to replace the burning of these fossil fuels. But now we have to have the political will to act. And that's why I'm proposing the keep it in the ground bill. And what this bill says is that a step we can take immediately is to quit facilitating the extraction of fossil fuels off of our public lands. So no new leases or new projects extracting oil, gas, and coal from our public lands or our offshore waters. It has been said that we are the first generation to experience the impact of global warming as we have on our forests and our oceans and our agriculture, and that we are the last generation that can do something about it. So let's do something about it. Let's act now and keep it in the ground.